Hey, this is Mr. Aiden. Welcome to Pre-Calculus Honors at Redeemer Christian High School. We're going to be doing a little bit of class introductions today. That way uh, we don't lose any time. And day one, we can get right to learning math and learning pre-calculus. And pre-calculus is an incredible, incredible course, but it is unlike any math course that you've ever had. This is probably what most math courses you've had was. Uh, and this is the probably most days of math courses that you've had is... You come into class, and what do you do? You go over your homework from the night before. And you are were clueless on the homework night before, but the teacher goes over it, and, and, and that teacher is showing you how to do problems, going over answers, and the teacher says, do you have any questions? And even though your face looks like this, you don't say anything. Okay. And then after the teacher goes over homework, then the teacher decides they're going to teach something new. And so they teach you a new concept. The new concept from today, which whatever you learned yesterday doesn't really matter with what you learned today. Uh, because today is the most important day in the math teacher's life. And guess what? You are clueless to what's going on. And guess what? Then the math teacher decides to give you a few problems that look exactly like the problems that they gave you. And so that math teacher then gives you some problems in class but guess what class runs out of time so quick doesn't it and guess what the bell rings you've only gone over about one and a half problems uh, which means you're not a master at anything other than really faking that whether you know it or not and so your teacher decides I'm gonna give them homework and your homework for tonight is problems 1 to 32 even even though one is not an even number and you go to do your homework at home and guess what you're clueless you're clueless you're frustrated you don't know what you're doing you're clueless and so guess what happens the next day the next day you come to class and you go over homework and the cycle repeats over and over and over again. It's not what we're going to do. Precalculus is not going to be this. Precalculus is going to be uh, not a normal math class. Not a math class like you've ever had before and that's going to be a good thing. What are you going to need? Well, you're going to need a notebook with some graph paper. Uh, you're gonna need a, you need a calculator. I, I I suggest two different calculators. If you if you think you're gonna be going into calculus, um, I would invest in a TI inspired CAS CX calculator. Uh, this calculator will do everything, including uh, make your lunch for the day. Uh, or get yourself a TI 84 plus. Uh, they're really very very similar in price. I would go with if I was gonna do anything with calculus, I would go with the uh, the TI Inspire calculator. I love mine. I'll show you how to use it. It is awesome. How do I grade? Well, 50% of your grades are going to be tests and quizzes. Quizzes are going to be one, worth one half of your test. And 50% of your grade is going to come from homework and videos and self-assessments, uh, which are videos and self-assessments. I'm going to show you what I mean by this. W where are we going to go for all of our homework needs? We're going to go to MrAiden.com. Okay, so MrAiden.com, put it on your uh, bookmark it, put it on your home screen. Do whatever you want, okay? And you're going to pull down this little tab and you're going to go to pre-calculus, pre-calculus. You click on pre-calculus, this is going to be our course. You can see pre-calculus is set up into semester one and semester two here, okay? And you can see semester one, we start off with chapter two, which is polynomial and rational functions, and we do everything by weeks. You can see every single uh, homework assignment and every single quiz and test are right here on mystery.com such as the change but this gives us a really good uh, schedule for the entire year what are you gonna do when you have a homework assignment due well you can see right here week one on 817 that's the first day of school so the first day of school um, you're going to have uh, 2.1 which is quadratic functions the nice thing is is you're gonna watch these videos before you come in the class which is nice uh, we're a little bit behind because of COVID, so we're going to, uh, we'll be a little backed up right here in week one, but it'll start to pan out in week two, week three, week four, so on and so forth. You're going to click on a video. You can see 2.1 quadratic functions. You click on this video, and up comes hey, this is Mr. Aiden. This is pre calculus honor. A video of me teaching quadratic functions. You can see first video is 15 minutes. There are some videos that are five minutes, some videos that are seven minutes. Um, it depends how many problems I'm going through. I'm going to teach you the section, 
Okay, and then you can see right here and right next to it is 2.1 self-assessment. You're going to click on that self-assessment. You're going to put in your last name. You're going to click next. You're going to go in and you're going to finish your self-assessment. Okay, you can see in this one match the following quadratic functions with the graphs. So 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, we have our graphs. Uh, this is not necessarily right. I'm just going to put in some answers here. You do number two, you do number three, you do number four. These, these self-assessment questions will be very similar to what I went over in the video, okay? And you press submit, you press view score, and you can see right here, I got one out of nine. That's awful, okay? But guess what, you're not gonna do awful. You're gonna be able to watch the video and do the self-assessment and the self-assessment is going to help to assess whether you really understood the video. If you do all on the self-assessment, you didn't watch the video. Okay, make sure you watch the video. Okay, it's a really easy part of your grade. So you can see you're going to be. We're not going to be going over homework problems in class. We're not. Going, I'm not going to be teaching you new things in class. I'm not going to be going over one and a half problems in class. I'm going to be teaching you outside of class. I'm flipping the class. You're going to be learning outside of the class. When you come in, we'll be able to do more and more and more problems. So rather than you doing your homework problems at home where your parents don't want to help you and um, your little brother and little sister are useless and Mr. Aiden's not there, you're going to be doing the problems in class where I am there for you to help as well as your classmates. And so I'm flipping the class. I'm not going to be lecturing in class. I'm not going to be teaching new things in class. Uh, it's going to be a discussion-based class where we can really go deep to learn our pre-calculus. And so you can see 50% of your grade comes from those videos and self-assessments. Okay, So if you watch the videos, you do self-assessments, that's 50% of your grade, which means if you do all the videos and all the self-assessments, and you get the lowest possible grade on tests and quizzes, you fail your tests and quizzes, the lowest grade you can possibly get is a 75C, which makes logical sense, doesn't it? If you do all of your videos and self-assessments, but you fail every single test, you still have a 75C, okay? Which means, uh, chances are, you're not gonna fail every single test and quiz, okay? Well, I have Aiton's 10 Commandments, man, man, of pre 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 calculus lessons. The my ten commandments of pre calculus. Here you go. Okay, this is what you want to do every day. Thou shalt show your work. Okay, show every step on your tests and quizzes. A lot of times, showing your work is going to be worth even more than the correct answer. Okay, showing your work. Thou shalt watch my videos. Okay, I spent a lot of time on these videos this summer and last year, and so. Please watch my videos. You stop it, rewind it, question it, comment on it, watch it upside down. I don't know. Uh, thou shalt do your self assessments. Do your self assessments. Your self assessments are very, very important to your understanding before coming into class. Thou shalt bring your calculator every day. If you don't bring your calculator every day, you will die. Um, just joking. Um, not really, but um, so I have some really dangerous chemicals in my room. So uh, thou shalt bring your calculator every single day, okay? Thou shalt be ready to discuss in class. That's what the videos are for. The videos are to help you to come up with questions. That way you have questions coming in. You're not the you're, you're not just clueless in class. Uh, thou shalt know it's okay to be wrong. In pre-calculus, I know in most math classes, the math teacher is really wanting you to find the correct answer. I'm not concerned with you finding the correct answer. I'm there to help you out when you don't get the answer right. That's why I'm there. Um, thou shalt work to understand each problem. Okay, Each problem has an understanding level to it, and that is one of my jobs to help you out. Thou shalt be ready for tests and quizzes. Your tests and quizzes, you know when they are. Uh, tests and quizzes are right there for you, and they the quizzes will be kind of one half of a test. and so. The quiz will really help you to uh, navigate the test and, and whether you're going to do well in the test or not. Um, thou shalt worry more about understanding than your grade. Understanding, understanding, understanding is way more important than your grade. And number 10, thou shalt look forward to taking calculus. Why? Because calculus is the easiest math course and the 
most amazing math course. It is like Dorothy walking through the door into now from a world of black and white to a world of color. Your math courses have been in black and white and guess what? Calculus is in color. You have the yellow brick road. You have the beautiful colors of Oz and calculus is the beauty that it is. And so why do we study? Why do we study this this course of uh, of pre-calculus? It's because our math our math declares the glory of God just as the heavens do. Our mathematics proclaims the work of God's hands just as the skies do. Day to day mathematics pours forth speech, night to night mathematics reveals knowledge. Mathematics has no speech, no words, no sound is heard from them, and yet the voice goes out into all the earth and their words words to the end of the world. The amazing thing about mathematics is it declares the glory of God and we get to do that every day in pre-calculus. I'm so looking forward to teaching you guys. Can't wait for day one. I'll see you soon. Bye.